Good afternoon. I'm Kim Baez. There will be no Halloween this year on the Hemis Pueblo. The reservation is joining the list of native tribes that are saying no to the holiday. Jeff Todd is just back from Hemis Pueblo with the story. Last week, a memo went out to all Hemis tribal members. The leadership of the tribe declared trick or treating and Halloween festivities off limits. It's the decision that has shocked some on the small Hemis Pueblo. It's a huge safety factor for me because I will be the ultimate responsible person if something should happen. And that's just one of the reasons Jemez Pueblo leaders say they're getting rid of what they call a Western holiday. Governor Madalena said religious leaders and the tribal council are in agreement. Our native traditions are very, very important to us. The Pueblo has allowed trick-or-treating for decades, but the governor said the small rural community just simply isn't suited for the festivities. During trick-or-treating time, uh, we have practically hundreds of kids walking on side of the road. You know, the speed limit is 30 miles an hour, which is still, to me, is very fast. You know, when you take a look at our village limits, we have no lighting in the village limits. It's dark. There's no paved roads. Nor are there any sidewalks. Crime is said to be another concern. We spoke with several Pueblo members who didn't want to go on camera, but they said they didn't think that it was a safety concern, mainly because most of the trick-or-treating doesn't happen here near Highway 4. They think that this is a knee-jerk reaction because of the recent murder. The FBI says this man, 22-year-old Lucas Toledo, killed, then tried to disembowel another Pueblo member last month. There's been rumor about possible cult involvement in the murder. I think it played a part. It did, you know, play a part, but it's not the ultimate reason why. But the governor isn't sure if the cult culture still exists somewhere on the Pueblo. Some of the tribal leaders we spoke with today said that they would rather celebrate a positive holiday, All Souls Day, which is the day after Halloween. That's when tribal members pay tribute to ancestors and family members who have passed on to the other world. Kim? Okay, thanks, Jeff. Now, Hemis Pueblo leaders say they are just doing what several other tribes in the state have done by prohibiting members from celebrating Halloween.